Step six, implement the intents to transfer data from this screen here to this screen here. Okay, so we are right now in the main activity. Specifically, we are at the onclick method. And we are going to add the intent functionality in such a way that if a user clicks on a single movie on the main activity screen, on the main screen, they will get taken to the details screen showing descriptions and details about that selected movie. Okay, so let's start in here. First of all, we can comment out this line, we don't need it anymore. And then let's type intent. Okay, equal to new intent. And in here, and this intent, we should add two activities the current one which is the source and the destination so the current one is this which is basically a reference to the main activity in here and our destination is the detail activity that one okay so let's type detail activity in there dot dot class well now we can just start this activity okay and we can pass that intent there Right, okay, so this will actually work, but the thing is, when a user clicks on a single movie, they will be taken to the second screen, but there will be no information shown in the second screen because we are not sending or attaching any movie information on this intent. Let's actually try this, okay? So here's the thing, let's rerun the app, here we are. And then, for example, let's click on Aladdin. Notice that we are taken to the second screen, but please watch that. This is just some static data, which says movie name, movie genre, uh, and this is some dummy text. So this is actually not information about Aladdin. And if we go to the show on the sheep, for example, the same thing will happen. Uh, we still get this default screen, which is some static dummy data, okay? So that means, my friends, we need to attach data onto this intent in here. And the easiest way to do that is basically to send the entire object. So let's create an object of our model class. So you can, of course, if we go to the model class, by the way, you can, of course, send individual data items on the intents, okay? So you can send these six times if you want, okay? But why do that when we can actually do it using a much easier way which is basically to attach everything on a single model object so movie and so the question is how do we know how do we know which movie the user has selected and thank god we have the position being passed to us to this method the on click method so we can use that so we can use remember our uh, our movie list okay which is defined in here somewhere right so we can use this movie list right now get and we can pass our position in there and now we have all the information that we need about the currently selected movie and then we can just simply send this and so we can just say in here intent dot put extra yeah here we are we are going to use this one see here we are going to specify the name of the uh, currently uh, of the object that we want to send because we need to reference this later from the detail activity and then we can see send a serializable object okay so put extra and let's just say movie object for example let's just call it movie object and then let's just say movie in here and by the way I have an error in here the reason is the model class, the movie class, does not support serializable objects. So we need to go to the uh, movie class, okay? And we need to set this class to implement serializable. 
Now there are many other efficient ways to do in this, but I think this is one of the easiest because there is only two words actually uh, right in my opinion. Okay, so let's keep things simple. And in the future, as you progress in your codes, as you get advanced with Android development, there is many other options that you can actually do. Do this. So now, as you can see, the error is gone. Okay, and now let's set this into a constant because that will make so that will make our life easier when we want to reference this back from the detail activity, okay? So, uh, let's use this command, alt, and c. Command, alt, and c, and that has created this constant for us, okay? See? It's right there. Okay. Thank you, and happy coding. <laughs> Anti, 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 Anti,